Is it on? I think so. Hello, we are from Hollywood High School and we are here today to tell you about the collaboration between our school and Castle Rock Edinburgh. They wanted a different type of annual report and so they approached the school to get a young person's perspective on the Housing Association and the different services they provide. We had a free choice in how we presented the report, so the first thing we did was to have a look at the types of things the Housing Association do. We had a look at all the services provided and pitched ideas in a dragon's den to find the best way to tell the organisation's story. People from Castle Rock Edinburgh then selected two to go forward for the production. The first idea was for a short film looking at the work of the energy advice team and the role they play in helping people save money on energy bills and at the same time play a part in saving energy use. Good for tenants, good for the planet. Oh, did you hear? No. About dog? What about? She had a man round the other day. Did she? What for? He was taught in a human. <laughs> Who was it? George Clay. He was fiddling with a thermostat. <laughs> Don't you, you make me blush. Oh, you're, you're wicked. Right, right, keep your beaks on. Where were you? Sorry. She called somebody from that Castle Rock Edinburgh mm -hmm. and they sent someone out from the, uh... Hang on, I wrote it down somewhere. Mm -hmm. Has anyone seen my glasses? Thanks. From the, uh... The Home Energy Advice Team. Aye. They thought it would be best if they moved the thermostat from the hall to the living room. Mm. Good. You can just ring up for a chat. Okay. Don't say they're dead friendly and helpful. I'm thinking of taking a leaf out of Dot's book. You're thinking of stealing what out of Dot's book? I said I'm thinking of taking a leaf out of Dot's book. We liked the film so much we were asked to do another highlighting the neat work that they do. That is helping young people not in education, employment or training. N-E-E-T Come on, get up. What are you doing about your future? Ah, uh, plenty. Oh, but what is it exactly? Hey, well, I might as well tell you that. I'm not going to college. Very funny. No, I'm being serious, I'm not. Well, what is it you're going to do? Because you're not leeching off of me for God knows how many years. I think you need to give me a bit of credit. If I was to leech off someone, I'd leech off someone who's loaded. You're not going to be leeching off of anyone. It's get up and go what you need, and that means college. I don't need to go to college to realise that the job prospects for people like me are non-existent. People go to college and get their qualifications and end up not getting a job in anything that they want to do. Don't be so dramatic. Folk who want jobs, get jobs. Come off it. There's a recession going on out there. Recession? Oh, don't start with this rubbish recession. You probably don't even know what the word means. Which is why I've gone for a job placement. Well, I've applied for a job placement at Castle Rock Edinburgh. <laughs> and who are Castle Rock Edinburgh when they're at home? <laughs> That's funny. What was? Well, it's because Castle Rock Edinburgh, the a housing association. And you said, in there. <laughs> Tell me about it then. Well, I was thinking of applying for the toilet programme. It's a six mm -hmm. months paid work placement for people with little or no qualifications. Okay. So that'll be the no qualifications for you then? I'm actually trying here, so... Okay, sorry. Carry on. Right, well, Scotty, okay, so he's just now, he did his, like, his six month thing, mm -hmm. and now he's doing his electrical apprenticeship. And uh, he's wanting to go into home repairs or something like that. But um, apparently the company's really good, and this girl won an award for them, and he's all dead set that he's going to get it, but it's not likely. That actually sounds quite promising, James. I know. Look. <sighs> for once they're interested in what I can actually do, as opposed to what qualifications I have. The other success in the Dragon's Den was for people to take over as photographers and editors of the organisation's publication, The Rock Report. Finally, we were asked to take part in a film about the annual review.
Edinburgh, Scotland's historic capital. Home to Castle Rock, Edinburgh, one of Scotland's leading charitable housing associations. Castle Rock owns more than 6,000 homes and work with over 8,000 customers across eight local authority areas. Boring, but it's an annual review. You need to know the facts and figures. People need to know how well they did. Look, 600 people moved into new homes. Boring. And repairs. 96% of people say they're happy with repairs. Boring. And 100% say they're happy with gas servicing. Hashtag boring. Oh. We are very fortunate to get an interview with the extremely busy managing director, Alistair Steele. Alistair, for the fourth year running, the company is making a profit. This year, a whopping 9.5 million. Why do you want to speak to him? He's just going to tell you boring information, like how we spent 6.5 million repairing and improving houses. It's so boring. We have to talk to him. Not going to see him. People need to know these things. Never, never, never. Castle Rock Edinburgh and partners Adam Dudley Architects and Historic Scotland were awarded the prestigious Low Carbon Building Award for their work on these refurbished flats. I'm here today with Chris Thompson, Head of Property Services, to find out more about the innovative tenements project. <laughs> Just a second, Chris. It's not going to be boring. I don't know, same age as my dad? Seems we haven't got time for that. So it's over to Alice. We are here today at the West Pilton Olympic Games. What do you mean we can't say Olympic? No, really, they'll sue. <sighs> Take two and action. We are here today at the West Pilton Games which just coincidentally is happening at the same time as another world famous sporting event. I'm joined here today by, by Shelley Hutton from Castle Rock Edinburgh who can tell me more. Hang on a second. N no, it's real. Have you got a hat? No. Where's the nearest hairdressers? Oh, run VT. Then we can go over to Robert and Rebecca from the Home Energy Advice Team. Oh, he's got a lovely face, hasn't he? They can explain how with property services, heat teams and the fit team got over a million pound extra money for folk. Hashtag boring. You are never going to speak to him. We need action, not talk. I've got it. Scottish Opera did a show at Letham Gardens Sheltered Housing. It was amazing. That's more like it. What, what's the VT like? Ladies and gentlemen, live from the historic capital of Scotland, Castle Rock, Edinburgh are proud, nay, chuffed, to present Scottish Opera in the Magic Fruit. Seriously, we have to talk to Alistair now. If you'd like to find out what happens when we finally do meet up with Alistair, or watch the other films in full, go to the Castle Rock Edinburgh website.